let's look at how we measure hemodynamics during a cardiac catheterization. We start by measuring arterial pressures, systemic pressure in the aorta, and right heart pressures, including pulmonary artery and capillary wedge pressure. Pulmonary capillary wedge pressure gives an indirect view of left-sided filling pressures and can signal congestion or left-sided heart failure. We also calculate cardiac output, which is how much blood the heart pumps per minute, and cardiac index, which adjusts this flow to the patient's body size. Measuring ventricular pressures shows how well each ventricle functions. Oxygen saturation levels help identify circulation issues or abnormal shunting. Together, these hemodynamic measurements give a real-time picture of cardiac performance. Hemodynamic measurements are useful in patients with heart failure, valvular disease, and congenital heart anomalies for shunt measurement.